Hello viewers, this is a quick video on how to install Msingi Pack for the Galaxy Tab A7 inch. Um, Msingi Pack comes in this particular packaging for the Galaxy Tab A7 inch. So when you purchase a Galaxy Tab A7 inch from a Safaricom outlet, you get this free micro SD card. On the back, you've got some instructions on installation and more importantly, your serial number, which you will need to activate the license for the application that is um, on this micro SD card right there. You have a micro SD adapter if you do need to connect this micro SD to another device such as a laptop. Now, this Msingi Pack application is uh, locally developed uh, by our partner Virtual Essence and it gives you a variety of um, content to help your child with their education and it's designed primarily for classes 6, 7 and 8. Um, it contains curriculum content in a variety of subject areas, um, English, math, Swahili, um, uh, geography and all the other common subject areas but uh, more importantly it also contains revision past papers which you can do on the tablet um, time revision past papers and actually um, get a score of that so it, it's also a perfect um, uh, solution for revising for your KCPE examinations so let's go ahead and just um, uh, release this packaging and um, and go through the installation process from Singipak so you can go ahead and just uh, break the paper like so. And you've got your micro SD card in there. So first thing to do is uh, of course mount the uh, micro SD card on your device. Uh, in this case a Galaxy Tab A7 inch micro SD card slot is right on the side of the device next to the SIM card slot. So let's go ahead and um, insert that. and it's in. Uh, you'll get a message micro SD card has been inserted um, as per usual and if you either click OK, uh, if you click OK this will disappear but let's click go to my files and when you go to my files then you'll find the Msingi Pack APK right there. That is a Msingi Pack application. Now the first thing you need to do before you actually click on this icon is go into settings and allow for the installation of this from unknown sources. Um, a quick shortcut on how you can do that is by just typing in the search bar unknown sources or actually if you don't want to do that, if you want to go through the long way, you'll go through lock screen and, and, and security settings and you'll find unknown sources right there. So go ahead and turn that on, unknown sources. Um, now, if we go back to my files, we can now uh, start the installation process for this. So there's your SD card that we've inserted and uh, there's a Msingi Pack APK. Go ahead and start the installation. Now, the Msingi Pack application, once you've installed it and once you've activated your serial number, then this application sits on your device. Um, it doesn't require an internet connection apart from when you're first running the um, activation of, of Msingi Pack. Um, apart from that, um, you can use this application offline anytime. So there we go, the application has been installed. We can either click done or we can click open. So for the purposes of um, this video, let's just click done and navigate to the home screen where we should be able to find the Msingi Pack application icon right there on the home screen. Now, as I mentioned before, you will need this serial number to activate your Msingi Pack license for the first time. Um, so you need an internet connection. Uh, but if you don't have an internet connection um, at the moment you're activating or, or at the moment you're starting the application, it will allow you to enter your serial number at a later time and activate it. Uh, for the purposes of this video, we have a, a internet uh, access already uh, set up on the Tab A7 inch and so that we can actually go ahead and do the registration. So let's click the Msingi Pack application. 
So as you can see, mobile learning and revision, you're about to activate Msingi Park on this device. Please ensure your device is connected to the internet to allow activation process. So you can activate now or activate later. If you choose to activate later, the application will remind you, give you another reminder to activate the license. So let's go ahead and say activate now because we have an internet connection and um, we have greeted with this dialog box where you either enter your name, your last name, phone number, uh, county and serial number at the bottom. So let's go ahead and just put as this. Uh, in Nairobi County and the serial number which is printed on the back of the packaging and let's say activate and there you go the Msingi Park application is now active so as you can see you've got lessons there to your left you have uh, KCP uh, right there to your left as well you have reports and that's for any subjects or any lessons um, and uh, KCP papers you may may have done um, license activation so if you choose to activate later this is where you'll do your license activation you can also tell others about this application and you can also actually have a weekly task schedule per class and per subject and uh, topical questions as well in a variety of subject areas. If we pick science and class 8, then you'll see the variety of units there. If we try out the KCPE revision past papers, again, subject areas. And if we were to pick Swahili, for instance, you get all the way down to 2005. If you were to pick one, let's say 2011, there you go. You have your questions and you have your timer running up there. So that's a very quick look on how to install and, and run the Msingi Park application. And just to show you that this application um, can actually run offline, let's go ahead and uh, switch off the, our Wi-Fi access there and uh, start the application again. Msingi Park, there we go, and you can see it's running. If we go into lessons, and let's pick social studies, for instance, and let's pick class seven. You can see all the units have loaded up, and we can pick a particular topic. And there you go, there, there's your content. So that's a quick look on how to install and run the Msingi Park application for um, the Galaxy Tab A7 inch and uh, as a final note uh, remember we have kids mode on this tablet so you can actually run that application in the kids mode environment if you're a customer or user of this device who wants to dedicate the use of this device particularly from Singipak. So uh, thank you for watching and goodbye.